We're at the secret spot, not near the beach. Jake Hill uh, just was like, hey, let's hook up this barrier. He's like, everyone always does like a bag or something and it just needs to get a good fix on it. It's a pretty sick barrier, good runway both ways. A lot of foot traffic because of the surfers and stuff. Yeah, this one's for Jake and he's the last one here and he probably lives three miles from here. Where the fuck you at, Jake? What up, Jake? Need great patience to get through. Well, you know what? Trash can over here. My life is always, always standing there. I need to call. 90 pound bags, there's a rough one in here, dude. So why don't you call and help us? Blue. Smells great. Electric bikes, dude. What the fuck? Melton's just not stop, dude. <laughs> yo, yo, this way. Hit the brake. Hey, back it up. This is a Type S Spec Mix Mortar, 94 pound bag. It's pretty smooth. Maybe I'll throw a little regular concrete in with this. Start using the good shit the end. So hard. What do you think, Mozo? It's looking good. There's no other way to have it. Plug in the hole of the barrier so we don't get our wheels caught. <laughs>
Good night, God. Lift with your back, not your knees. Good night, God. So the other night, we spent about five hours fixing up this barrier. Everyone who was passing by was just like, yeah, fuck yeah, that's sick. It's about time somebody did it, blah, blah, blah. Seemed like everybody was hyped. We hung out an hour after dark before loading up the truck. The middle of the barrier, which is the thickest in concrete, was still sort of wet, you know? So we're like, let's give it a whole day tomorrow to cure, and then we'll skate it the following day. Actually, Taylor Kirby's dad cruised by in the morning to check the surf, and he sent uh, Jacob some photos. Somebody came here and uh, kind of smashed out all the stuff that wasn't dry yet. I don't know why, who knows why, who cares actually, but uh, it's kind of a little setback, but we're just like, fuck it, we can fix it. We use some uh, faster setting concrete, some cement doll, so it'll dry quicker, so nobody will have the opportunity to smash it out because we're gonna be here all day. It'll dry in a couple hours and then we'll get a session on it. Happens DIYs, you know, like they could be hammered and just fuck it up or whatever, it doesn't matter. Yeah, we started at seven this morning and it's about 9.30 now, we're almost done. It'll probably take an hour to dry, so yeah. We win. These are not gonna be sitting around like waiting for it to dry, you know what I mean? Good night, job, like this. Good night, job, like this.
down. Scrub it, Coop. <laughs> If I could dump concrete on my phone. I had my phone in the hole. And then Mel was like dumping, he's dumping, and then I was like, ah, he's gonna stop. Nah, he ain't stopping.